hello hello welcome back to my channel welcome here if you are new i am daquana white i bring you plus size fashion content as well as lifestyle and beauty content today i'm super excited to bring you all my she and fit plus video which i think is technically i guess we'll just say my september <laughs> she and fit plus video but it might have been for last month either way i wanted to go ahead and get these pieces out the way because fall is here or approaching and these pieces are kind of like mm, you can transition into fall with them but i feel like they were summer dropped but by the way i want to thank shein for sponsoring this video my coupon code will pop up on the screen but it will also be listed down below along with the links to the items so with that being said if i have any rambling i will save it for later let's go ahead get through the pieces and we might get into some housekeeping but the elephant in the room hello short hair I just wanted to try something different and I like it she's cute she's mature okay this first piece or first set that we have is like this black I think it's in a US 24 and it's a two-piece like ribbed not necessarily mesh but it's very very breathable and it's a little bit sheer when you look at it like holding it up so I would definitely do black undergarments or nude just for that this for me is kind of like a lounge around the house so I saw this as a lounge around the house but I do see it with some knee boots and a trench coat if you want to transition it into fall and by the way I know I wasn't supposed to ramble I will have a lookbook coming for you all it may not be a renaissance lookbook but I will have some looks coming just for the fall and transitioning and all of that so the back of this y'all know I'm not really a big fan of shorts but I just was like I mean it's something cute you know and that's why for me I would probably pair it with a duster or a trench something a little longer in the back so I don't feel so naked but I do like this I feel like the material is very very breathable and just overall this is a comfortable set whether I dress it up or just lounge around the house. I just knew this was going to be so freaking cute with a pair of orange boots. I was so mad when I put this on and y'all it did not work. It would not go around the butt area like it went to like right here and it was like no we're not going around the butt. It is like a windbreaker material so you know doesn't have any stretch or anything this is a 24 i should have got the 26 28 because yeah i'm so sad about this i mean i thought this would be really cute to go to renaissance and i know renaissance been like silver and pink and glitter but i feel like this like with a bunch of orange accessory accessories <laughs> accessories would have been really really nice but yeah that's this piece we're not gonna hang up too much on it let's just go ahead and get into the next set all right so here we have this rust three piece set and i think this is bomb i don't know what it is it's giving me nostalgia because i remember like like the orange skirt I had on with the short curly hair that was like not a viral picture but it was like one of the moments when I first started my career as an influencer and it's just nostalgia okay <laughs> but I love this for fall I could see this with sneakers when you go into a pumpkin patch I could see it with booties knee boots heels like I can see so many possibilities here I did get this in a 24 I do feel like a 26 would have been more comfortable because I feel like this could easily just rise up up and now would just look you know a little young whereas I would want it to just sit perfectly like oh my goodness but I will say I love the color it's also that ribbed breathable material just like the black two-piece set love that this has a duster I wouldn't even have mine if these were shorts or a skirt because it does have the duster attached really really cute love her down I think for me I probably mm, I'm going homecoming shopping. I'm going to do some homecoming hauls. But I think for this piece, I would go with like a knee boot. Like right under the knee. Not over the knee or thigh. But like a knee boot that's like camel or cream. Maybe even black. But I don't know. I don't want to look like a pumpkin on Halloween. But I think a camel or like a cognac boot would be so cute here. And like some accessories. Like the purse. That's what I would do with this. But you'll see all of that in like the future lookbooks and stuff. Because I always talk about what I would do. But y'all need to see it. Okay. So here we have these two pieces let's start with the top it just says motorbike on it. it's like a graphic tube top I actually like this and it matches my freaking Kim Jones Air Maxes so perfectly with the orange a little bit of yellow and the gray it does have like different shades of taupe and just black throughout in the graphics so I like this it's simple it's affordable and I got this in a 22 because sometimes the tube tops from Shein Fit Plus do tend to run just a tad bit big so I do like the way this one fits I love how it looks I just took my bra straps down so I'll probably do a strapless with this or no bra so then we have these pants and the reason I didn't have on my heels for these is because I wouldn't wear these pants with heels I would wear them with like a boot or a sneaker and I would keep them wide you can pull the drawstring 
hamstring and make them like jogger style. Let me see if I can do that for y'all because y'all, hold on, <laughs> like we on the phone. So you can make them like that. I'm not a fan of that look. I would keep them like this. And this was gonna be a part of the Renaissance lookbook and I was just gonna do like a silver everything up here, like a silver little risque top and just silvered out, right? Maybe even a gray wig. <laughs> and then like a silver pointed toe boot. I thought that would have been really cute with this. I don't like it this way love it this way these are 24 i was scared they wouldn't fit i will say it's a little dip in the back i have on a high waist like brief so you'll see that but yeah other than that i actually like the way they fit and they do have pockets i have these huge charms on my nails so it's hard to do freaking anything so remind me never to do this again ever wearing these long old nails with a trial haul knowing i gotta film a bunch of hauls today crazy all right so these two pieces okay i love them both separately now together i would probably throw on a white boot i don't really know i just don't see these pieces together but even if i untuck this right it just looks like eh unless i wore it open maybe but i got the top in a us 22 i love the abstract art on it it looks so good i wore something like this to an art gallery opening and it was beautiful with the white boot and a jean loved it the only thing about this like i said it is a 22 and it still has a nice amount of room so i would definitely say get your true size or size down just because it does have like an oversized fit now the skirt i got this in a 24 and i was happy <laughs> that i got it in a 24 and it's like a, a sweatsuit material it's not tracksuit it's not cargo but it gives a cargo look these pockets are functional it does have function and belt loops i love the way this fits no zippers or anything you just pull it on now it's a skirt so it fits short right this is how it looks in the back okay I can deal with that. Now for me, I was like this skirt, with, I'm in love with trench coats now, dusters, utility, trenches, all types of things, right? Not utility trenches, utility windbreakers, in love with them. So I was like, ooh, this with like a knee boot, like a bralette and a trench or something would be fire, but I really wanna wear it with a knee boot and a chunky sweater and some tights. I think that'd be really, really cute. Now this shirt, like I was saying, I don't really know how I feel about it just as is. Like I feel like it looks better open and then you wear a bralette underneath and then do the white boot and all of that. So I don't really know, but that's these two pieces. We have a few more things to get into, not too much, but we do have a whole nother Shein curve haul to film amongst so many others. All right, so here we have these two pieces. Let's start with the top. Also got this one in a 22. I don't mind the 22, but I feel like the 24 would have gave me just that amount of coverage, which I would want from this, but I'm still gonna wear it. So anywho, this is like a crinkly sheer material. Underneath, you can do a bralette, a cami. You do not have to keep it all sexified and you know, risque. Now for me personally, I love it with this skirt, but not this color skirt. So for this outfit, don't mind the dogs, they ain't doing stuff. But for this outfit, I would do a khaki or a brown chocolate skirt so that we could keep it like news and neutrals maybe uh what is the crocodile material or look type of boot that's brown or tan and then purse is tan everything would be news and neutrals is how i would do that outfit with a bunch of gold jewelry i think that would be fire but i do like the shape of the skirt and maybe even if i was to do a skirt with this i would do tights underneath so getting into the skirt i got it in a 24 now this one is more so of a cargo feel but you still have the elastic in the waist it does have a functioning button and zipper works really nicely the pockets they are functional as well i had to make sure <laughs> they are functional i love this skirt i like the shape of it it's not bodycon they're just doing a lot in there <laughs> anywho it's not bodycon but it still gives you definition at the waist and it does have functional belt loops now this is the length of it in the back again i'm not really a short skirt and short type of person i don't feel like it's too bad i feel like it's fine the top goes to about there nothing too bad about it but personally i would probably do tights underneath or just a longer jacket but then i'm like if i wear a jacket you won't get the feel of it so yeah 
that's these two pieces here. My sister is about to take her senior photos. She asked me to help her put some outfits together and she likes cape pop and stuff and she's infatuated with certain types of fashion. You know, the platform shoes, the skirts, dresses, you know. She's a K-pop girly, <laughs> but no, I feel like this would be such a cute outfit for her. I love it for myself as well. So let's get into the pieces. We already talked about the skirt. Let's get into this sweater. Now I've been seeing these sweaters. They've been very popular, but they have the 3D ones as well, which I will have in my next Shein haul for you all or the one before this, whichever way I put it. Super infatuated with like the floral or flower print sweater. I think that's super cute. I would probably just want a different color. I got this shirt. And a 2830 I think and then the sweater is a 22 that's odd maybe I wanted to wear it as a top but it actually still feels a little oversized like a cardigan love this sweater it's amazing it's lightweight it's perfect for the transition it still has the flowers from the spring and summer but it has a little bit of the warmth that we need in the fall so love that now paired with this button up I got it extremely oversized because I wanted to wear it like when it looks like you have nothing on underneath, y'all know that vibe. So yeah, I wanted this to have a super duper boyfriend feel, oversized boyfriend style button down. I love it. It's a nice material. It's not super thick. Like I feel like it's a little bit sheer, so still watch what you wear underneath. But it's so nice. Like I love the way it falls. I did not button all these buttons because like I said, these nails, no ma'am. But you can see it closes. <laughs> so then, boom. I wanted it to have that feel. Then underneath, I will do a short and a tight and a booty. And maybe even like cinch it at the waist if I wanted to with like a corset belt. I think that'd be super cute. But as you can see back here, it has a little bit of a length to it, but not too much. All right, so I didn't want to strip, but I wanted to make sure it is a 2830. So definitely size up in this and I love it size up in. And also it has inner and outer buttons. So I thought that was really cool when it, you know, comes to the button down part. But that is these two tops. Have another bottom and a top and then we're gonna hop into our next haul okay so here we have these two pieces i definitely wouldn't wear these pants with heels i could see it but that's just not my style honestly it would be a boot or a sneaker but then again i also don't like jogger pants like that but i got these in a us 24 they fit so nice they have a great stretch y'all already know i had got them for renaissance i don't know how i would have styled them but that's what the whole lookbook was based around they do have pockets love that love the white stripe on the side and i also love that it has a white complimentary drawstring which is functional and it's a cute pant it actually looks cuter on than i ever imagined <laughs> i didn't even know if it would go on this is how it looks in the back okay so i know everybody was doing the silver the silver look all right this top i wouldn't necessarily wear these pieces together but if i would to do it or if i were to do it i would do it tied up because when i wear it down it, it just it's not giving the girls what it needs to give like it, it's not it's giving something but not it but i do like this top down as well just not with this style pant at all regardless of the color and i got this in a 24 26 and you can of course but in it love that i love the color blocking and it actually reminds me of spring but the material is given fall so i don't know now i did get like a pocketbook and some shoes and stuff but i'm just gonna save that for my shein curve haul just because it's more accessories like purses and things like that so i typically do the curve and accessories together and i let the fit plus get its own shine so once again let's thank shein for sponsoring this video everything that i tried on will be linked down below and linked on my ltk what else i don't really have that much housekeeping i've been posting every sunday with the vlogs shout out to the editors y'all they keeping me afloat all right now it's just way easier everything runs way more smoothly and i just can focus on content so it's really really fun really exciting and refreshing so with that being said i will catch y'all in my next haul don't be shy comment down below thumbs up the video all that good stuff Love is back.